Good afternoon, everybody. Ken Gonzalez here for Georgia Langevin Productions. We are at the 2011 Surf Cup. A U15 match just underway. The SoCal Blues dodge against the Crossfire Premier 96 Baumgart. Crossfire in the blue and white. And, of course, the SoCal Blues in there. Very prevalent, very loud, neon, lime green jerseys. And SoCal Blues in their own backfield as they're moving from right to left. We'll get you the rosters for these two teams. This bracket play, first round, so there will be no overtime here. So the game will end after that final whistle at regulation. We can end in a tie. And let's see what... Referee wants the ball way back here where the original infraction was. It went against the Crossfire squad. Crossfire out of Washington State. In fact, I had the pleasure of watching their U-12 team play a little bit earlier today. Ball into the backfield. Defense has got to get over as the Blues come into the defensive third. Actually, much even deeper than that. They're near the back line, but the ball cleared out over to the far side. Put into play by the Blues. Crossfire number 13, far side. That's Carly White. Ball here near side, into the middle. Number eight for the Blues, that's Jocelyn Orahel. No score just to start of things here, first half. So we await now the ball to be thrown in far side by the Blues. Near the corner. Nice, strong, high throw comes in on the header towards the net and on a bounce into the hands of the Crossfire Premier keeper, Reagan Gibbs. Ball near side, number one for the Blues. Or for uh, Crossfire, I should say. Emily Johnson. And number eight for the SoCal Blues, Jocelyn Orahel comes over to boot the ball out of play to stop the momentum. Number five, Caitlin Willis puts the ball into play. Ball far side of the field. Crossfire tries to come inside, but the SoCal defense Pretty tough there, knocks it back out. Now across midfield. Too many blue jerseys there for Crossfire though, and uh, the SoCal Blues unable to get any further into Crossfire territory. Little push to behind there. Referee says play on, get up. Cross midfield, now the Blues want to isolate number 17 here, Lauren Woodyard. Shot to the net over the crossbar, and actually that was going to be well wide of the net. And so the goal kick here coming up for crossfire. Reagan Gibbs with the kick. Nice strong kick to midfield and on a bounce across midfield. Back to her keeper. And let's see, that's number 18. Alex Best. So Alex Best, keeper for SoCal Blues right now. 
Ball in the middle of the field. Inside the circle, let's see who comes out with it. Number 21 for the Blues, Sidney Magnin. Little collision there, far side. Let's see who comes away with the ball. These two teams at the onset here seem to be pretty evenly matched. Pretty quick teams, too. Ball rolls near side here. Crossfire, fires it across midfield. We'll get you their rosters here in a second. As soon as the Blues release the ball out of their backfield, now the action here in the middle. So for the Crossfire Premier 96 Bumgard squad, number zero, Veronica Chung. Number one, Emily Johnson as that ball goes out. Number three, Taylor Secura. Number four, Courtney Fedor. Number five, Caitlin Willis. Number six, Kennedy Kineker. Number 10, Margot Marahe. Number 12, Emma Morris. Number 13, Carly White. Number 14, Jamie Farrell. Number 17, Isabel Marquez. Ball still in the middle of the field, going back and forth. Number 18, Megan Bolabol. Number 19, Taylor Wines. Number 20, Antonia Anastasiu. Number 22, Aaron Swain. Number 32, Claire Johnson. And the keeper, Reagan Gibbs. So the goal kick here for the Blues. We'll get you their roster. Alex Best right there, she's a the keeper. Mia Hummel, number 13, also a keeper on this squad. Number two, Nikki Rosen. Number three, Tori Buda. Number four, Katie Pingle. Number five, Isabel Damiani. Number seven, Annika Rodriguez. Number eight, Jocelyn Orgel. Number nine, we watch the action here real quick. Get back to the roster in a second as Crossfire coming into the defensive third of the Blues and now cleared back out. Kaylee Kelly, number nine. Number 10, Sarah Roberts. Number 11, Alex Marietti. Number 14, L. Graham. Number 15, Stephanie Lowry. Number 17, Lauren Woodyard. Number 19, Erica Okuma. Number 20, Jen Munoz. Number 21, Sydney Magnin. And number 22 is Miranda Schultz. So there's your roster for each of these squads. The Blues bringing it across midfield. They got some room now, streaking down the middle, number 17, Lauren Woodyard. They get the ball to Lauren. She's going to be angled to the far side now, inside, shot towards the net. It's going to be wide and still scooped up there by Reagan Gibbs, the crossfire keeper. That ball is going to get past the Blues defense and the keeper best, Alex Best, is there to scoop it up. Could have been dangerous if, if Crossfire had some help up front, but that ball was let out too far, too fast, and their, neither team was really ready for it. All right, Crossfire dribbles it up towards midfield. Fires it across. Number four for the Blues running it down, Katie Pingle. And the ball is out, far side. Number five for the Blues, Isabel Damiani. All right, for the Blues, number eight, the left leg up across midfield. Crossfire back the other way. Crossfire now. Let's see if they've got an opening, number 13. Carly White. White still dribbling, moves to the far side. Now with the left leg, fires it just over the crossbar. Nice attempt there by Carly White. Just a little bit too much on that one. And the goal kick to the SoCal Blues. All 
right, here's the kick. Down the middle. Crossfire with the touch and the win. Now they bring it again into the backfield of the SoCal Blues. Ball at midfield and now the Blues bring it back the other way. Thread in the needle between a couple of defenders. Number 17, she isolates for a shot. She's got to change direction. Defense comes over to help out. Still in trouble. Now she brings it back up top. Shot to the net over the crossbar. Number seven, Annika Rodriguez for the Blues trying to take it herself. But the defense there for crossfire, pretty tough. Didn't give her an open look. They all came in and collapsed right around. And so now the goal kick. Reagan Gibbs. Ball at midfield. Now in the left half. <laughs> Blues bring it up across. Now they've got a little bit of momentum. Number two. Nikki Rosen with the pass. Gets back to the ball. She's going to fire it to the net from outside and scooped up there by Reagan Gibbs right into her chest. She'll release it. The drop kick across midfield. Blues have some spreading there on defense. So they make it tough for Crossfire to do much there. Now they bring it back the other way. Number seven, Annika Rodriguez again. Try to make something happen, passes it to the back line. Number 19, Erica Okuma there. Okuma forced into the corner, still in play. And it does finally go out across the back line. Last touch by the Blues, and so the goal kick over to the Crossfire Premier. Ball left half. On the ground. Rodriguez coming inside. Tries to get past the defense. Now she's got to hold up. Change direction. She's going to lose the ball. Up to number 19. Taylor Weens. Taylor passes it here near side. Upfield pass is going to straddle the line and go out. Ball to the far side, number nine for the Blues. Kelly. Kalea Kelly. And let's see here. Is there substitution? No. Ball's out, and it looks like number 11 for the Blues. Alex Marietti will put the ball in a play far side. Marietti's toss inside. Can they get a shot? Number 19 tries to make something happen there for the Blues, but just can't do it. Erica Okuma. Too many defenders there in her way for crossfire. Ball goes out across the back line, though. Off crossfire, so that'll give the Blues the corner kick. All right, here comes the kick with the left leg bent towards the keeper, and she goes over the back. Reagan Gibbs, nice job. She was determined that nobody was going to get a shot on goal, and Gibbs. Goes into the air to snag that ball before anybody can touch it. Number 14 for Crossfire, Jamie Farrell. Farrell tripped up there. Number 13 picks up the slack, Carly White. 
Far side, pass to number six, Kennedy Kineker. Kineker to the net, on a bounce into the hands of the keeper. Alex Best. Substitutions here for Crossfire right at midfield. Number 18 now into the match, Megan Bolibol. All right, let's see who's going to take control of this ball as it's finally on the ground. Crossfire had it momentarily. The Blues take it away. Just as they make their way upfield, it goes right back to the right half. Gibbs fires it upfield. Blues will keep it, though, on the left half. Into the backfield now of Crossfire. Can they get a shot? No, deflected away. I'm not going to call that a shot on goal. Off number three. There's Taylor Secura. And that will give the Blues the corner kick. This field plays east-west. The wind coming in from the west, from the coast. Moving on your screen, left to right. Shot to the net, right past the diving keeper. Did it go in? It did. The Blues with the score there, all led off or fed off of that corner kick. And the SoCal Blues have taken a 1-0 lead. That ball fired right past the keeper, Reagan Gibbs. Just between Gibbs and that far post. 1-0 in favor of the Blues. Crossfire wanted to send number 18 here. Megan Bowleyball down the near sideline on that kick. Alex Best for the Blues, fires it on a bounce across midfield, and that's going to go out. Crossfire now will have it. Bit of a careless mistake there, gives the ball right back to Crossfire Premier. All right, the Blues with that 1-0 lead. Trying to get right back where they were before into that defensive backfield of Crossfire, but not this time. Crossfire knocks it back the other way. It goes out off the Blues. Ball at midfield. Blues will control it as it's on the ground, Crossfire trying to get it back, stepping into the lane right there. I think that was number six, Kennedy Kynicker for Crossfire, deflecting that ball away.
Crossfire in the middle of the field. Moving the ball now far side. Blues will take it away, number eight. Jocelyn Orichel. And the ball is out. Let's see, last touch by the Blues. Quickly, Crossfire puts it back into play. Number five, Caitlin Willis. Beautiful afternoon. This game time, 325 here on field 14. We're at the Polo Grounds. Del Mar, California. Blues coming across defensively. Number 22 now trying to bring it up field. Miranda Schultz. Number six for crossfire Kennedy. Kennedy Kineker. Number 17 battling there for the Blues. That's Lauren Woodyard. Crossfire keeps the ball out of their territory. Ball still in play far side. Crossfire, Crossfire uses that far sideline. Number zero, Veronica Chung. And substitutions for Crossfire coming in. Number 20, Antonia Anastasiu. And Margot Margay, number 10, coming in. Number 14 for the Blues, trying to dribble it between a couple of defenders, L. Graham. Number two, right at midfield, Nikki Rosen. And the free kick to the Blues. Keeper will take the kick as she comes out. Ball far side. Late here in the first half of this U15 match. Each team battling here in the middle of the field. Blues with the ball left half of the field. And again, they're gonna be thwarted. The ball sent back the other way, and again. So back and forth, each of these teams, nobody really getting out and after it offensively. All the action in the middle, back and forth. Blues with that one nil lead. And the Blues will want to substitute right now at midfield. So a couple of sets of fresh legs in there now to round out the end of the first half here. All right, the kick comes in. Both teams battling just outside. Blues now trying to work their way inside. Number four, Katie Pingle. Ball rolls to the far side. It goes out off of crossfire. And the Blues will put the ball into play far side. And as it comes in, goes right out again. And again, the Blues have it. Again, they put it into play. Rolls to the back line. Still in play. 
defense for Crossfire, trying to push him out that far side. Number one with a nice job right there, Emily Johnson for Crossfire. Wanted that ball to go out off of the Blues player after she kicked it right into her leg. And just as Crossfire gets into SoCal Blues territory, the defense collapses and now they bring it back the other way. Number 19, Erica Okuma has the ball taken away by Crossfire's Number 20, Antonia Anastasiu. Ball rolls towards the back line. And it's the keeper, Alex Best, who will pick it up. There's the kick up towards midfield in the middle. Collision there. Ball rolls here to the near side. Orgel fires it across to number 22. Miranda Schultz into the middle with that pass. Two players collide. Player for the Blues slow to get up. I believe that's number four, Kitty Pingle. Quickly, Crossfire gets it right back in, and it goes out again. This time to the Blues. And the Blues would like a substitution at midfield there, coming in. Number 20 will come out. Jen Munoz. All right, Blues put it in near side. Number 13 for Crossfire takes it. Carly White now rolls to the far side. Who's going to get there? Chung, number zero, Veronica Chung. Her cross into the middle cleared out. Number 22, again, Miranda Schultz. Schultz guarded there by number five, Isabel Damiani. Ball's gonna roll to the back corner, that far corner. Blue saved it now. They're going to knock it out far side off of. But it was off Crossfire. No, actually off the Blues. Crossfire will put the ball into play. Coming up towards the end of this first half. Blues trying to clear it out of their backfield. Number 19 with the chest right there, Erica Okuma. Chong fires it back the other way and the Blues are there. They'll send it back up to midfield. And just as Crossfire tries to bring it across midfield, there's the whistle on the end of the first half. So the Blues, with the score about midway through this first half, will take a 1-0 lead into halftime. I'm Ken Gazoster, George Langevin Productions. This U15 match between Crossfire Premier and the SoCal Blues will continue in just a few minutes.
All right, welcome back to the show here. Second half of this U15 match, the Blues and the Crossfire Premier. Crossfire Premier trailing 1-0 as we start this second half. They'll be moving from right to left on your screen in blue. The SoCal Blues in that neon lime green. Pick up towards midfield and for the crossfire. Aaron Swain now at keeper. For number 60, Reagan Gibbs. The Blues now on the attack. Defense getting back for crossfire. There's the header towards the net. Picked up right there by Aaron Swain. Ball in the circle now here on the right half of the field. Crossfire trying to clear it out across midfield. They do. Blues will move it far side. Defense has got to get back for the crossfire squad and misfire right there by number 22, Miranda Schultz for the Blues. Crossfire will take it away. All right, ball moving into the far side near the corner. Stop changing direction now for the Blues. Moving inside, there's a shot towards the net. That ball's gonna find the back of the net. Tough shot, angled from the far side. Past a diving Swain, the keeper. Not much Aaron Swain could have done right there. It's placed perfectly over her hands. And the Blues have taken a two nil lead here early in the second half. Oh, crossfire. He's got to get back now. Get back on it. Try to do something. They got to cut this lead in half as soon as they can because then that will leave them time the remainder of the half to tie this match. And now the Blues on the attack again. Ball across midfield. In the circle now. Crossfires, number six in the middle. Nice pass. That was Kennedy Koniker. Now on the ground over to the keeper. With that shot. Koniker with that pass was number 20, Antonia Anastasiu. That shot to the net. Number three for Crossfire is going to get to that ball. Taylor Secura. Secura upfield with the pass to number six, Kennedy, Kennedy Kynicker. Nice strong upfield pass to the back line. Nice job of the Crossfire defense clearing it away from their backfield. Now to the circle. Crossfire now on the attack into the backfield of the SoCal Blues. Number 13 gets back to it. Carly White, there's a whistle. And let's see here. That'll go against the Blues. And so the Crossfire with the free kick there. So number six, Kennedy Kynicker will take the kick. 
Here it comes with the right leg towards the net, and the ball is just wide of the net. So the goal kick to the Blues. Number 13, Mia Hummel, now the keeper for the SoCal Blues. Ball bounces across midfield. And number four for Crossfire will fire it out across the far sideline. Katie Pingle. Or I'm sorry, that's Courtney Fedor. All right, the action now. Far sideline, crossfires defense gets back number three, Taylor Sakira. Blues will have it far side. They have the 2 0 lead. Another goal here would be devastating for a crossfire. Kick comes in. Bounces out. Can they get a shot? Deflected away. Nice job by the crossfire defense here on the near side. Fired up towards midfield. Slowed down. And now into the middle. So ball out across the back line. Number 22. Aaron Swain will set up the goal kick. Swain's kick over to the far side. Number four for the Blues, Katie Pingle will pick it up there. And the ball out. All right, throw comes in. Let's see if the crossfire defense can keep the Blues out of their backfield here. And they do right now as they push it up towards midfield. Ball gets past the defense. The keeper comes out. Swain deflects it away. The ball's still alive. Rolls here to the near side. And for a crossfire. Up to midfield, stepping in the lane now for the Blues. Number five, Isabel Damiani. Damiani with a left leg, fires it to the net, right of the hands of Aaron Swain. Nice job by the crossfire keeper to haul that one in. Ball bounces here to the near side. And out of play, both players roll over each other. And let's see, it's crossfire ball. And crossfire wants to substitute. Number 19 will come in, Taylor Weens. For number 20. Antonia Anastasiu. So that whistle was against the Blues. Free kick right there for a crossfire. Fourteen with the pass back. That was Jamie Farrell. Jamie gets right back to it. Nice slide right there. Taking the ball away from the Blues, now across midfield. Crossfire now on the attack, right down the middle of the field. Fires it to the net, and picked up by the keeper, Mia Hummel. Crossfire battling for the ball here at midfield. 
Number two for the Blues, Nikki Rosen. Number 32 for Crossfire there, Claire Johnson. The left-legged kick. Go to the far side, now thrown in by the Blues. And let's see, the ball is out, belongs to Crossfire. Aaron Swain with the kick. Ball on the right half of the field. The Blues leading this one 2-0. We're at the 2011 Surf Cup. And both teams battling a lot of physical play right there for the ball. And that whistle will go against the Blues. Crossfire will have it. Ball near side here. Into the backfield, crossfire on the attack to the back line. Number 13 is going to run out of room there. Carly White and the goal kick now over to the SoCal Blues. Mia Hummel, the keeper, will take the kick for the SoCal Blues. And Crossfire now, they got to win this. They've got to keep the action here on the left half of the field. Get another look at the net. Cut that lead in half. Now they're on the run again. Carly White, far side, number 13. There's the cross on a bounce right in the hands of the keeper. She had number 18, Megan Bowley-Bowl. Streaking down the middle. But the keeper stepped up and was able to catch that one on a bounce. And so the free kick here for Crossfire. Ball at midfield. And which is where, you know, that's where Crossfire, they want to keep it there or to the left half. You know, they don't want to retreat back into their half of the field, into their backfield, trailing by two. They want to keep the action up top so that they can capitalize on any opportunities. They need to put some more pressure on that SoCal Blues defense, make them work harder. Maybe tire them out here towards the end of this second half. And they do bring it across midfield. It goes out off the Blues. Crossfire. Into the middle, now rolls here to the near side. Veronica Chung, that strong pass into the middle of the field. Crossfire still moving the ball, spreading the field. Number three steps in, keeps it in front of her, Taylor Secura. Blues dribbling it into their own backfield. Ball on a bounce across midfield. Crossfire gets back defensively, send the ball to their keeper. To the net, now that ball's gonna roll here to the near side. It's gonna be a foot race, see who gets there. Nothing but Crossfire jerseys so. though. So Crossfire will pick it up. Farrell with a kick up field to number one, Emily Johnson.
So on the whistle, free kick goes over to the Blues. Just about 14 minutes to go here in this one. 2-0 lead for the Blues over Crossfire. Nice defensive job by Crossfire there. Ball rolls down that far sideline, number three. Again, number three for Crossfire, Taylor Sakira. Taylor's been very active here today. Cruising that far sideline, does a shot well over the crossbar. Goal kick to Crossfire and Crossfire would like substitutions here at midfield, number 12. Emma Morris will come into the match. So Morris is in. Swain's kick up field. Crossfire now with a short passing game, trying to bring it up across midfield. They do. Emily Johnson's going to lose it. Blues in the middle now, off to number four, Katie Pingle. And that shot towards the net is going to be wide, and it'll go out. So another break there for Crossfire as the Blues, they're looking for an opening. They're taking some shots that may be a little premature. They're up 2-0. One more score, and it's going to be very tough for Crossfire. So, you know, SoCal Blues may be wasting some opportunities there. Instead, maybe trying to set something up. See if they can push that score in. Battle here at midfield. And on the other side, Crossfire. They've had some luck getting into the defensive backfield of the Blues as of late. They still need a score here. All right, the Blues are operating here on the near side. Now it comes back out. Into the middle and the keeper, nice play by Aaron Swain. Diving for that ball. Kick off the leg of number 17, Lauren Woodyard for the SoCal Blues. Blues bringing it across midfield. And the whistle there, it's going to go against Crossfire. So the Blues will have the free kick. There's the kick on the ground. Stopped there by number 19, Taylor. Waynes and Taylor catches a break for Crossfire as they bring it up to midfield. But the Blues are there, and they bring it right back the other way and will bog down Crossfire in their own backfield again. Ten minutes remaining here. In this U15 match, again we're at the Polo Grounds, Del Mar, California. Just north of San Diego. Huge weekend here in the area. Big, big surf. Big Surf Cup tournament this week and next week. And then in downtown San Diego, the Comic-Con convention going on. Ball on the left half of the field. Now it's Crossfire's turn to make something happen. Getting past the defense, trying to make them work. Moving it here to the near side. Crossfire wants to push it into the middle. They do. SoCal Blues get a leg on it, but not enough. And now finally they'll come away. Crossfire keeps it here on the left half of the field. 
Nice job coming back to that ball by Crossfire's number 18, Megan Bolibol. There's the cross, and now the Blues are out and running. Number 17, Lauren Woodyard. Lauren with the left leg tries that shot. Deflected by Crossfire, now comes back the other way. Ball right at midfield in the circle. Rolls to the far side, let's see, goes out. And it is off crossfire. And substitutions now for the SoCal Blues. Ball into the corner, far side, and they're going to run out of room. It goes out across the back line. Goal kick now for Crossfire. Let's see where Aaron Swain goes with this ball. You know, that's very tough. Uh, Swain's position right there, you know, when she's releasing on those kicks, she's going right into the wind. And if she keeps it on the ground, you know, that's where some trouble will start because the Blues players are up front and it's going to be tough to get the ball past them. So a tough situation there for Crossfire here in the second half. Of course, in the first half, the Blues had the same situation. But they've got the wind to their back here in the second half and the 2-0 lead. So that ball goes out across the back line, but it was last touched by Crossfire. And so coming from that far corner, the corner kick for the Blues. Here it comes, just a little short, deflected out. Blues trying to keep the action here. Deep into the backfield of Crossfire. Towards the back line, still in play, and now finally out, and that'll be a goal kick for Crossfire. Nice job by the defense. High kick. And the flag goes up. And the ball goes over to the SoCal Blues. To the free kick far side. Just about five, six minutes remaining here in the match. Beautiful day here, the 23rd of July, Saturday, 2011. Game time here was three, actually started a few minutes late, started at 325, I think it was scheduled for 310. Another full slate of games tomorrow, semis and championships on Monday. Into the backfield, the defense gets there for the SoCal Blues. Crossfire still not out of this thing. They can get a score here. Anything can happen. So they cut that lead two to one, but they got to get that first score shot towards it. A dive by the keeper to her right, but ball out across the back line. And let's see, was it last touched by the Blues or Crossfire? She didn't get a hand on it, so last touch by Crossfire and the goal kick to the Blues.
All right, ball across midfield. Number 19 for the Blues will take control of it there. Erica Okuma. Shot to the goal, nice job there by the keeper, Aaron Swain. Ball's drilled right at her. She'll release it, fires it up to midfield. Again, the Blues will win it. Okuma there, number 19. Number 32 on defense, Claire Johnson for crossfire. So the ball belongs to the Blues far side. Blues number four, looking for somewhere to go. Katie Pingle into the middle now. Veronica Chung, zero, number three. Taylor Sakira. And number 32 there on defense, Claire Johnson. Ball goes out, belongs to Crossfire. Aaron Swain fires it upfield. Wind dying down right now, so a good time now for Crossfire to try to move their way upfield without the wind hampering them. Into the middle now, number 13, Carly White. And the ball taken by the Blues. Chung gets there, nice job defensively. Ball stopped, number 12, Emma Morris. Ball rolls here to the near side and out. So Crossfire will put it to play here on the near side. Substitutions for the SoCal Blues. All right, Crossfire, Veronica Chung. Off to number one, Emily Johnson. Crossfire trying to move it into the middle. There's the cross pass. Deflected away by the Blues over to the far side. Nice job there, number 32, Claire Johnson. Getting that ball. And the ball is out off of the Blues. So Crossfire with a break right here. Final minutes of this game. Ball at midfield, now across. And if you're the Blues, now you just want to keep the action in the middle of the field, maybe into the backfield of Crossfire, but uh, you just want to run this time down under about two minutes to go. Whistle goes against Crossfire. The kick right here at midfield for the Blues. Right at midfield, number six, number eight, I should say, Jocelyn Orgel for the Blues. And there's the whistle before they can get it back in in the end of this U15 match. And it is the SoCal Blues with a 2-0 victory over the Crossfire Premier 96 Baumgart. We're here at the 2011 Surf Cup.
I'm Ken Gonzalez for George Langevin Productions. It was a pleasure to bring you this fine match. We hope to see you again soon. And until then, be safe and have a great day, everybody. Hey everybody, thanks for joining us here at the 2011 Surf Cup. You just watched the U15 match, the Crossfire Premier and the SoCal Blues. And it was the Blues taking this one as they shut out the Premier here at the 2011 Surf Cup. Hopefully, we'll see both of these teams both here again next year. Take it easy, be safe. King is awesome, George Langevin Productions.